Hey everyone, Tankenstein here. In this video, I'll be opening up 55 Danger Zone Loot Crates, the trophies that they offer uh, for the update Danger Zone. And the purpose of this video is one, so I can see what sort of loot I get, but two, to show you guys what the realistic uh, odds are when it comes to actually opening these, because as you can see, it just shows you some dice here. Low, average, average, that doesn't really tell you anything. So this is going to be a demonstration of that. So that said, of course, please like, subscribe. The more people that subscribe to my channel, the more views I get, and the quicker I can recoup the money lost by this because Gaijin is not reimbursing me for this video. So that said, let's start to open these boxes. Gamblestein is back. So we got 55. I was originally going to open up 50, but something happened, and I way miscalculated. Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's see. I'm really hoping for some... Oh, uh, they are really just drawing this one out. Yo, actually, you know what? I was going to buy that yesterday. No kidding. Cool. That's exactly what I want. Okay. Um, cool. <laughs> That's actually really, really neat. But, uh, yeah, I'm hoping for some some vehicles here. Um, you know, of course, I'm not really expecting any sort of vehicle. Uh, you know, I've got the T-3485, so that's cool. Okay, this is actually pretty nifty. I've got two usable uncommon skins. And you know what? They're, they're calling all these skins uncommon. They must be calling these all uncommon now. Because there is no way that these are all uncommon skins. A lot of these are probably just, uh... Oh, I've got the M1, or M18, rather. All of these are common. A lot of them are common. They're just calling them uncommon so they can make you feel better whenever you get them. I'm not seeing any rare skins, though, so I'm wondering if they're just kind of, um... I don't know if the, the word isn't homologate, but, um... They're all just making it whatever. I got the B-26. I've got something for every sort of vehicle I own thus far. That's interesting. Never had that happen. I really want the ME-262. Like, that is my thing. I already own the, the UU. Or whatever it is. Uhu. <clears throat> um, actually, I do not own the Puma. So, that'd be... That's cool. I like that. We got 50 more. So, yeah. I mean, this is something... You know, I've opened up uh, the rookie trophies, and I want to do this every few months just to kind of, one, because I think it's fun, but, well, it's not really all that fun. But, um, you know, I, I feel that it's, it's fairly important to have these sort of videos because it shows you the realistic odds of getting anything that you might want. Because, you know, it, again, it just shows you the dice in the corner there, and what does that really mean? You know, seriously, like, what does this mean? Average chance? That's it? Like, that's stupid, <laughs> you know? Um, the camouflage is cool, and of course, these are all uncommon. You know what? That's interesting. There's no ultra rare camouflage. I wonder why. I really wonder why. Like, they, they've taken, like, all the common, rare, and ultra rare out, and now everything's just uncommon. That's interesting. That would be cool. I actually almost have that. IL-10? I don't mind. But yeah, I mean, it's 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 somewhat important to do. Um, because, one, I don't want people to play this game. and Well, I do want people to play this game. But I don't want people to get addicted to certain... Oh, sweet! Sweet! Um... To certain aspects of this game that are not in and of itself gameplay. So this is not at all gameplay. This is just like their their gambling feature. Um, and something like this is something that uh, I feel like you have a lot of people. Uh, I don't know if you'd call them whales. Uh, you know, in, in pay to win games like Diablo Immortal, for example. Well, pay to win. I don't know if you could call that pay to win, but pay to win. Let's just go with that. Sweet, I've got that. Um, you have a lot of people that literally spend hundreds or thousands of dollars or tens of thousands of dollars that they might not have just to be able to spend. And um, 
unfortunately, they, they end up playing these games and they just buy a lot of cosmetics or X or Y thing. And it's just really unfortunate because you have a lot of people out there that cannot control their spending. And, um, you know, hopefully by showing the realistic odds, because, I mean, yeah, you could open up 10 of these and it'd be like, you know, interesting, I suppose. But you're not really getting a big enough sample size. I, I feel like after 50 or even better, 55, you have a pretty decent idea of what your odds are of unlocking X or Y thing. I really want that, the, uh, the F-82 skin. I've gotten three of these? No. Okay, you know what? I was going to get that one too. Wow. A lot of these, I guess, are, are things I already own. I didn't know that. Um, that's pretty good. Well, I mean, I own the vehicle, so I don't own a lot of these skins. The Wyvern skin. <laughs> they probably include that because it's like, hey, man, you want to buy the Wyvern? <clears throat> Which I personally don't. Uh, but, hey, it is what it is, right? I'm hoping for, for some sort of thing. Another thing I'm noticing here is that they do not have any sort of Chieftain Mark III. That's cool. Um, that that there's no sort of... Um, they're really limited in how many vehicles you can get. Um, I'm not sure exactly why, but it feels like the camouflage to vehicle ratio is substantially higher than it used to be. Uh, you know, you used to be able to get two, three, like there were a lot of vehicles that you'd go past and now it just feels like there are hardly any vehicles. That'd be cool. But, um, a lot of camouflage. The 234 four. That's, that's funny because no one owns that thing. Like you, that vehicle used to sell for like, two thousand dollars fifteen hundred dollars on the marketplace and it came when i was like on a little bit of a hiatus from war thunder so i didn't unlock it but man that would be so oh i'm not gonna get that if i were to get that man the m60 ambt talk about something that's expensive it's that thing right there holy cow and, like, no one, I really doubt, I'm like, I'm sure that there's still a fair amount of players that play the game who have the Puma and unlocked it naturally. You know, rather than purchasing the Puma, they just kind of have it. But, ooh, that's cool. I have that. Nice. But that thing's got to be, whoever gets that skin, they're not making anything on it. <laughs> you cannot resell it. And the thing is, most of these skins, you put them back up on the marketplace, even if you do make your your what 249 back for the uh, price of the okay that's cool even if you make your your 249 back for the price of the uh, key it doesn't matter like let's say if you sell a skin for 249 Gajin's taking like 10 percent of that <laughs> you know so you are not really gonna come out on top either way unless like you sell something for 10 plus and i feel like actually you know what come to think about it i think that gaijin is striking a, a middle ground here right so they don't want well maybe i don't know i was gonna say like maybe they don't want like the prices to be too high on the marketplace but maybe they i mean why wouldn't they um now yeah, i've gotten this one three times now that's been like what I've had 23 unlocks. That's almost, that's been more than 10% of my unlocks has been the IJN uh, Shinano, or was it Shinano? Ah, geez, I'm forgetting already. Ah, uh, man, my brain is mush. Okay, I've gotten that one twice now. There's still 31 left to open, guys. Remember, you know, Gamblestein is back. And in order to, to recoup these losses, I am going to really need a lot of use <laughs> i mean so on youtube the theory is is that it's about 1000 views you get make you make two dollars on youtube i don't i make less than that and um ooh, that would be really cool but the thing is is like you know i make kind of close not really though and um 
Yeah, in order to actually make this back, I'm gonna need. Let's just let's just assume I had 200 or uh, yeah, like two two dollars per thousand views. That would be really cool. That would be, no, I'm not gonna get two dollars per thousand views. So all this, I mean, you're talking 55 keys, and then the crates were not 50 cents each, or they were not 10 cents each, like a lot of other crates. Because I'm opening this, like, right when this all comes out. Uh, so, you're talking an average price of around 25 cents per crate. 50 of them. Um, like, 12.50. So, 12.50, and then you have 55 keys. 2.50 would be... So, that's around 145, if I'm not mistaken. So, in order to make $145 back, I'm going to need something like 75,000 views. So if you guys can get me 75,000 views, do it for Gamblestein. <laughs> Just, <laughs> then I might be able to make back some of my money before tax. And then tax comes in because the government loves me. I freaking, ah, uh, don't, uh, I hate tax. It's like any YouTube creator's bane. Ooh, that's cool, I've got the, the BTD. But, yeah. So I'm going to need somewhere around 75,000 views. And that's very hopeful views, mind you. Uh, doing probably like 90 or 100,000 views would be more like it. Is what I would actually need. Oh, come on, come on, gimme. I mean, I've got either one of these, but this is the obviously less cool one. The Panthers were one of my favorite vehicles in game. And to have had that Panther skin would have... Uh, gone some way not much but a tiny bit towards making me feel a little bit better about not getting any special vehicle here man am i gonna get this like i feel like the ones i'm landing on four or five times or three or four times whatever those are the ones that are like tr actually common skins and they're not like you know <laughs> three dollars but ten cents oh man RBT5, that would be so cool. Wait, did I just unlock this? Like, I, I, I'd i rather have this. But, of course, how many of those do I have? I'm going to have to check. This is ridiculous. Got 22 left, of course. And the thing is, and I say this with all of my videos where I've unlocked these. This is probably like my fourth or fifth one thus far. When it comes to... Oh, sweet. They didn't give me the, the stupid one for once. When it comes to opening these chests, it does this fake animation here. It's not fake, obviously. It's happening. Oh, that'd be really cool. It's not going to happen, but... Obviously, like, this animation is occurring, right? But it's not like, oh, you almost had it, you know? It, they don't do that. That's not something that War Thunder actually does. Um, better said, whatever your selection is, so whatever you win, was predetermined the second you clicked on that button. That's it, you know? They do not go around, oh, come on. Nope. Gosh darn it, man. But as soon as I click yes, boom, all of a sudden you are, your, your selection has already been chosen. So it's kind of the illusion of, of actual gambling. Um, you know, but Gaijin, you know, it's not some, some employee that, that's like behind the scenes saying, okay, he's going to get the PF109 F4 North African camouflage. Wait, isn't the F4 already very similar to that with its standard camouflage? And if I'm not mistaken, it's very similar. Maybe not with the white bottom, but that's weird. <laughs> But, you know, it's not some Gaijin employee working behind the scenes saying, eh, you know, I'll give him the CTZ-99A. Sweet! You know what? <laughs> I've actually got a video for that coming out, so that'll that'll be really cool. Because I have not done anything towards that video yet. So, by capturing the gameplay with that new skin, that'd be really nifty. I would like that. I like the Wolken Mouse. Of course, I'm not going to get... So, I'm going to get something I already own. Much rather... I can get my third or fourth M18 skin. Yeah, that's cool. Jeez. This is awful. This is as bad... 
like maybe ever since those April chests, Gaijin has just decided, you know what? I'm not going to make any of these fun. Any of them. Come on, please. Stop. Ah, come on, man. This is... <laughs> and it's funny because by opening all these crates, you almost kind of go into a... Um, uh, what, what's the, the five stages of, of grief? Oh, man, wouldn't that be something? Wouldn't that be some? Oh, wow, they, they must have increased the BR. I just got that one again. Oh, my God. It's like... Or not the five stages of grief, but, like, you can tell the more and more people open of these, the more and more their their spirits are broken. Until eventually their, their like, reptile mind kind of forgets that they lost everything. And then they're like, ah, well, you know, I can do this. Oh, that'd be really nifty. Sweet. And then you think, eh, you know what? It's five months. I forgot exactly how bad the odds are. And then you open them again after a few months. That's that's the cycle, you know? Like, they, they release these updates in the trophy uh, boxes just infrequently enough where if you took, like, a huge loss or, like, a beating... So oh, wow, that's cool. Like, a beating opening all these doesn't matter you know you're gonna forget by the time that uh that the next trophy unlocks come out so it's just <laughs> you know i might be upset about this now but in three months well i probably won't i'll probably be opening like 25 of these in uh in three months i'm not gonna be opening all of this stuff that's ridiculous but an x amount of uh of months i will have forgotten the pain that i'm going through today and it'll be all better and hopefully they change up this system. I mean, it's just skins. Oh, I'm not going to get it, but that'd be so cool if I did. Like, they're not even showing. They're not even, like, saying, ah, oh, you're getting close. They're just saying, nah, you're not getting anything. <laughs> it's ridiculous. That's just absolutely ridiculous. Oh, that'd be so cool. This is the one I want. I already have, ah, it's going to screw me over. Man, as soon as I told the game, man, I want the Panther D skin. <laughs> it's like listening to me. Man. Let's see what other one. I've gotten this, gotten this, gotten this. I already have this. But that would be so cool if I could sell it. Are you serious? Are you serious? Are you serious? It's my first one. The first one I've ever unlocked. Praise be. Holy cow. It's the first vehicle I've ever unlocked. Wow! Wow! Holy cow! I mean, I already own it. I already own it. But man! Uh, through... <laughs> Holy guacamole! Wow, what are the chances? It's the first time I've opened up like 300 of these chests. Not including... Actually, include if you include the April chest, probably like four or 500 of these chests in total. Not including even the rookie tro well, the rookie trophies I wouldn't really count. Because um, those have like they have a pity system where you have to unlock a vehicle. And I've pretty much been like do a vehicle. But with these, it's just camouflage. And by complete chance. Wow! I unlocked a vehicle! I wonder how much that thing sells for. It's I think it was like $45 last I checked. 45 uh GJN, but it's equivalent to 45 USD. Um, oh, man, wouldn't that be so cool if I got something else? Even if I already own it. If I got something else like that, then I could make some of it back and maybe do another one of these vid videos with much less pain and suffering. Wow, I got it. Woo. Holy cow. I got something. You know, I mean, uh, uh, I might not have won the fishing tournament, but I got a big fish. That's what matters. I mean, of course, it's still a waste of money. Don't get me wrong. Like, even if I <laughs> make $40 back on that $50, I'm still out uh, a lot. And I can't reconvert that to USD. Oh, that's cool. I, wonder how, I really wonder how much that thing's going to sell for. Because who, like, what's the the market for that? Like, what Gaijin employee was like, you know what, needs a skin? <laughs> the the Pack Puma. 
there's no market for it like it's such a, an uncommon skin or an uncommon vehicle although actually once i was in a match and i have uh that gameplay up online i was in a match with like i i rented like i i can ask Igen for rental vehicles you know so i rented the pack puma one match last year i was in a match with two other pack pumas i got it i got it that's so cool it's such a cool skin but yeah i was in a match i got one more guys let's hope for something good but i was in another i was in a match with two other pack pumas so there were three pack pumas and at that point they were selling for 1500 each on the marketplace which means that was like a $4,500 match, not including the other vehicles in that match. Pretty crazy. And I actually teamed up with one of them uh, flanking on a road, which was unusual. Oh, man. Oh, my gosh. No way. Of course, no way. They're going to get... <laughs> Sandwiched between two things I do not need. Man. Or sandwich between two things I do need or want. Man, if I could have the ME262A2, I love that thing. But of course, I've gotten another M18 GMC. I'll open up these in a separate video, I think, because I'm I'm done with this. <laughs> um, okay, let's check out the skins because that's like the majority of it. So what I get? Got one of these. Got three of these. Three of these. Three of these. Two of those. Three of these. Two of those. Six of these. Oh my gosh, two of those, three of the uh, Shinanos, uh, the Congo Shinano skin, two of those. I mean, that was a cool one. I have the Tomcat, well, kind of have the Tomcat. It's on rental, but I'm about to unlock it. But, um, yeah, not too bad. I wanted this, and I got three of them, so I guess that's cool. I mean, some of these actually sell for a decent amount. I'm going to put them up immediately. Because if I don't, then the prices decrease. I mean, right at the beginning of the pack of the trophies uh, is when these are at the highest. So I'm going to sell them off. And then I got the F7F3. The reason why, and when you look at this, the reason why I've not actually uh, consumed these skins, it's not because, or these vehicle things, is not because I'm looking to sell them, uh, whatever I can sell, but it's rather just because I don't feel like crewing these <laughs> so you know and, and i'm not gonna be playing these anytime soon but anyways thank you so much for watching please of course like comment subscribe i would greatly appreciate that wait i got five of those danger zone things are you serious i got five of those how anyways i please like comment subscribe you guys know the deal yo i would greatly appreciate it and uh, i've got some some pretty cool content coming out this week again i'm running my uh just running on full gears full volume here for the danger zone update so i'm gonna be doing a few more reviews and some gameplay here and there but either way thanks again and i'll see you all on the other side take care everyone